we were finally feeling like we were ahead of the game. We had some empty kennels, and then we started filling back up, and then it hit again. Megan Poffenbarger's heart dropped when she got the call. Another hoarding case in Butler County. The house was disgusting to say the least. It was in deplorable conditions. Uh, there was so much clutter around. The staff at Animal Friends Humane Society quickly made their way to a home on Hill Avenue in Middletown. Police were there and found a rundown house with a homeless camp in the backyard. And they discovered 31 dogs, two ducks, and a cat. A lot of them had feces up on their legs that didn't look like they had been bathed. Um, almost every single one of them had fleas on them. Some of them had flea irritation, so they were starting to lose some of their hair. Two people found at the now condemned house are facing cruelty to animal and drug charges. The conditions here are just like a case animal friends dealt with last summer. In that case, 86 dogs were found in horrible conditions at Helping Hands for Furry Paws Rescue. With the number of dogs that are constantly making their way into the shelter here, staff say they're having to look at new ways to house the dogs inside. We can house 120 animals somewhat comfortably, um, and we were already kind of maneuvering dogs through the facility and putting them in pop-up kennels. Shelter staff were having to move kennels into play areas to accommodate the growing population. The shelter is also continuing to provide resources like a pet food pantry for people in need. Poffenbarger says they're always here to help. We want you to keep your pets, but we want you to keep them healthy and happy, um, and we don't want it to be a strain on your family. In Hamilton, Tyler Madden, Local 12 News. Thanks for checking out the Local 12 YouTube channel. Click the links and tap subscribe to get notified anytime we post.